So hey YouTube, uh, time to go to uh, go to a junkyard and have some fun. Well, bye, fui, fui. You just gonna lay there? Yep. Okay, I'll be back in a little bit. Our junkyard's about a thirty-so minute drive, but uh, yeah, I'll show you on the way out there. Okay, I'm gonna pull it first. Mm. Ah. The big jeep, the old big jeep. Got my big bottle of water. Yep. Just in case. Uh, never know when you'll need that. Oh, hey, don't go. Not the other one. Oh, look at that sad face. Who can resist that? <laughs> yeah, well, we'll get back to you when we're on the road. this gold one. Found what I needed off of it. Limited Cherokee. Ooh. Keep looking. This one don't have many Jeep parts, but need to line this up like it so much. Stuff gets heavy after a while. I was at the junkyard looking for some things. Uh, didn't find most of it. Usually you don't really find what you're looking for at these things. Ours are kind of small and it's rare that you get any anything of real value because they tend to take it off and sell it separately. But when I did the heater core on this thing, I messed up the plate. So I found one that was pretty much brand new that I'm going to put in there. 
And this thing I messed up too. So I found one of those that I'm gonna put in. So you gotta take out some screws in this thing. This slides out and you can pull it out. Pretty simple. But uh, I'm gonna do that and we'll get back to you. And, and uh, that's what it looks like now. Yeah. Either way it turned out. Still gotta find a knob for that thing. Alright. For me, um, yeah, gonna go start taking down stuff because it's supposed to rain really hard here a couple of days. It was that hurricane. But, uh, yeah, that was it. Probably gonna mess with the truck some other time. That was wrong. Now, if anybody knows how to, on these glove compartments, how to get the key out of these things, I pried this one out, but the one I stole from the junkyard doesn't go to my key, so I pried this out of there. But if anybody knows how they come out to where I can put them in to the other one, I mean, it is a Jeep. I don't really care. I don't use nothing in the glove box, but I guess the aesthetics are <laughs> whatever. But, uh, yeah, found one of these. This one's all scratched up and crap, so it's been a whole five dollars and whatnot i wasn't looking to see if there was any v8 grand cherokees that i could take and use the um what was it the tie rod those are a good upgrade for those and i think they're like 10 or 20 bucks from the junkyard didn't find any that were worth taking all the ball joints in them were just garbage ripped up and stuff uh didn't find any Dana's with lockers already in them. I'm still hoping for that one day. Because I don't want to buy them and do them myself. Too, too much time consuming. Who knows? Well, I don't know. I might do it. It depends. <sighs> yeah. Then walk around look. See if there was anything else worth taking. Uh, well, I guess that's it for today. Probably... It's a short little video, doesn't really have anything in it, just throwing it up there. <laughs>